what's up guys it's albino duck here um, in this video I'm going to show you a tutorial about how to use your um, razor naga to keybind into um, your general games I'm specifically going to be aiming towards world of warcraft um, when you first get your razor naga um, you're gonna have to download um, the razor synapse 2.0 which is this program that I have open here. You can go to um, Razor's website and you can go into their um, downloads and stuff under the links on there. So once you have this downloaded, all of these buttons here, there are going to be already going to be binded. It's really confusing when you first get it, like 2 and 8 and 6 and 4, they are moving like forwards, backwards, right and left, which really I don't understand why they'd want you to do have that. So, um, they're already pre-bound which really screws everything up so you don't really understand how you can um, basically bind each key separately so what, what I did here is for each of my buttons 1 through 12 I did control 1 control 2 as you can see listed through all of the above what this allows you to do instead of just having um, just a number there which is also also bound to your keyboard as you can see in WoW you have all of these numbers here it's going to automatically think that you're trying to bind these with your with your naga which is not what you want to be doing you want to make separate key bindings as you can see here I have um, my uh, key bindings right here and see how it says C1 and then it goes up through there um, what the C means is what it's activating control and then one so it's a whole different key binding structure is what it's doing so if you go through here you can edit it and you can do like control 2, control 1, whatever you want to have and you can change it and then what you're going to want to do after you get this done and also another thing it doesn't matter if you have it in uh, number mode or num lock mode 1, 2, 3 or num um, for uh, what we're doing here because we're not going to be using the numbers because they're bound differently so once you get into WoW you're going to want to um, go to key bindings and then um, you're obviously going to want to find out which uh, what spells you want bound to where and let me see if I can find here I have all my spells here bound to my naga that I use I'm not using full all my full 12 keys but as you can see here when you bind one of the keys um, it'll automatically put in control and then that number so um, Razor should probably do a more clear job of how to do this because it's pretty confusing you probably when you first get the mouse and you don't understand how it's working you're probably be, gonna be pretty scared that you're not gonna be able to bind all your keys so um, I hope this helped it's really simple but um, it's it, it's really confusing at the same time so if you guys want me to go over any more um, Razor Naga macros for a warrior mage anything really I'll be doing a review on the Naga and I also have a Razor Nostromo which I will be doing um, tutorials on about how to bind that also. So thanks for watching guys and rate, comment, subscribe. Albino Duck signing off. Thank you.